So this is my first time on the U.S. side, but still just as pretty. It's so cool. Hello! <laughs> it's been like two years since we did our last vlog and we've had some upgraded equipment some updated editing skills and we're gonna give it another go. We thought that this one would be a good trip to vlog on. We're going to Massachusetts for the MVP Open. We're actually on our way to Niagara Falls. We're gonna stop there before we go to what looks like Worcester, Massachusetts, but Bart's saying that it's... Wooster. It looks like Worcester. How does that sound like Wooster? But that's where we're going. We're headed there. We're actually gonna stop tonight before we get to Wusta, and we'll be there tomorrow to start our first practice round. So we'll see you guys there. Maple Hill and this is actually day two of practice yesterday it was way too rainy I didn't bring my camera out and I was pretty devastated because I thought that today Thursday was also gonna get rained out but actually the hurricane totally blew over yesterday and it's a beautiful day out here so my friend Casey De La Pena she is at the underscore disc golf girl on Instagram she reached out and wanted to play around so we came out here to take advantage of the weather and here we are so we got some good shots and hopefully I uh, can show you some cool throws along the way. How do you like the course? Yeah, turn it over. Good. On a beautiful 65, maybe 70 degree day. It's good. It's hard. Dude, what it's like. 
You can sponsor a hole and get your, so you can get Christine, realtor Christine Jennings on the sign. I'm going to sell houses in Massachusetts, guys, because yep. I have my license in Ohio. Yep. Get it. Okay. <laughs> Good morning. It's tournament day and we're excited. The weather is going to be so nice. And yeah, I just woke up, me and my morning glory. I have my Invisalign in and I feel like I talk with the lisp, but we're just gonna keep going. And I thought that I made French vanilla coffee and it turns out that it's French vanilla cappuccino. Can't decide if I'm mad about that. Yogurt, granola, bananas, and then I have toast with marmalade, it's strawberry marmalade. It's so good. And then grapes, I have coffee that I'm making. And then yeah, pickles. I don't think that's gross. Like, I enjoy pickles and I think that they're good snacks because I mean, the chips are so like thin and crunchy and like, they're so good. So, I don't know. I mean, I don't have anything salty in my breakfast. I try to eat like wholesome foods, not a lot of processed stuff. And there's my breakfast. Hey guys, how's it going today? Yep, it's going great. great. I shot uh, way under my rating. He tried, treated many players and we're good. Yep. And now Bart's going to get a whole loaf of uh, whole tray of bread. Right there. Yeah. Yeah. Yep. Christine's going to eat a lot of pasta. A lot of That's carbs, so I have energy for tomorrow. Pasta with Italian dressing on top, <laughs> what I heard. <laughs> Don't forget the meatballs. Yeah. And the meatballs. to quickly recap our MVP trip to close out this vlog. Um, yesterday was our last day. The weather was kind of gloomy, but we made the most of it. We were still playing Maple Hill. It was still a really pretty course. Um, that was my first time there, and I didn't have a good first round, so I didn't know how I felt about it, but then after that and after I started actually playing to my potential, I really enjoyed the course and it is a really good course. So yeah, it was just a really cool experience. We had a really nice Airbnb. It was really pretty, like everything was just really relaxed and chill and the weather was really nice. So yeah, I had a really good time at Maple Hill for my first time. How about you, Bart? It was not his first time. It was great. It was great. I loved it. Perfect. Well, we are on our way to Smuggler's Notch now, so I'm gonna close this one out and I'll see you guys on the next one. Thanks so much for watching.